We caught up with him during the opening of New Mexico Highland spring football practice. Fan favorite and former Lobo quarterback David Vega is getting one last ride of collegiate football with the Cowboys. RJ Chester has more. Uh, yeah, it was influential, and I'd like to thank the University of New Mexico and their football organization for uh, letting me uh, live the D1 experience. But from now on, uh, we're just really focused on the Highland stuff and trying to move forward with our journey here. Roswell native David Vega was a walk-on at UNM where he appeared in five games in the 2013 season. Vega showcased his natural ability, exuded confidence, and it was evident this kid left everything on the field. Um, just everything that I brought to the table before, so it's just basically my competitiveness, just try to get out here and make the team better in whatever way I can. I've always been impressed by his athleticism, his ability as a quarterback. I'm excited to see him out here on the field. I'm excited to see what he can do. And, uh, you know, we've both been on different journeys, and it's pretty cool that we're here together, and I know he's fired up as well. After David Vega's stint at UNM, he had the chance to go out of state, but he chose to stay here and come to New Mexico Highlands because he believes in this program. I came on a visit here, and I really like what uh, they had going in the program and the people that were around here. The, the players that were uh, a big part of why I stayed here, they really dedicated and uh, really bought into what we're trying to do. Going into his senior year, Vega's on track to graduate with a business accounting degree, but he still has other plans for his future. Football's always the main objective for most of us out here. That's why we all do this. Um, of course, there's always plan Bs and this and that, but uh, football's my main focus right now. 2015 marks a new chapter in New Mexico Highlands football, as Vega and the rest of the Cowboys are all in. Yeah, we're all looking forward to do something great this year, and uh, just come watch. Jared Chester, News 13 Sports, Las Vegas.